So, hi guys, day one of Astrocon. Uh, we, the exhibit just opened. So we're here at the Counterpart booth, a Canadian company that does SIP soft phone. Uh, and we have Mark here, a manager at Counterpath. So, hi. Mark, what does Counterpath do? Well, Counterpath is a leading provider of uh, unified communication applications, uh, both for the PC, the Mac, and for um, fixed mobile convergence applications. Um, the reason we're here today is we're launching a new product, a beta program for a new product called XPro for Asterisk. XPro for Asterisk is a, uh, is a soft phone it's designed to work exclusively with and tightly integrated with Asterisk, both open source, uh, Digium commercial versions of, uh, of Asterisk, and OEM, Digium OEM uh, Asterisk implementations. So how can I get XPro? Well, you can go to uh, www.softphone.com slash asterisk, and uh, you can join the uh, developer program. Um, or not, sorry, not the developer program, the beta program. And um, if you join the beta program, uh, one of the, uh, the features of uh, XPro for Asterisk is you'll get five free uh, copies of the phone to, to install on your Asterisk server. Mm -hmm. But if you join the beta program, you'll actually get 10. Okay. So you can also send an email to uh, XPro at counterpath.com. So what's so special about XPro? You know, uh, what's all, do you have presents and all those things? What's so special? So Let's tell them. It's, uh, it's leading technology that's built upon the same technology we used to build X-Lite, which many people in the uh, Astros community know about. I use X-Lite. We use X-Lite a lot. And, uh, and our iBeam and Bria products. But uh, As XPro for Astros is designed to be tightly integrated with your Astros server. The idea is if your line has an Astros license, XPro for Astros license, your phone will work automatically. So you literally log in and you're using your phone. You don't have to manually configure the endpoint. And the administrators can manage who has and who doesn't have access to the, to the uh, soft phone. So before we go to the demo, can you tell us when, how long does the beta run? When is it officially going to be launched? And well, it's, it's, the beta is limited time. Okay. So as, as little time as we need to be able to launch the product, we're probably around four to six weeks. Okay, so probably uh, two months down the road, you guys will have a pr production oh, running? Sooner than then. Okay. Sooner than then. So now maybe I'll let Derek uh, from Counterpath. Here's Derek. Derek, hi. So Derek will show us uh, the demo. All right. Naveen, can you zoom in? Uh, the, the main advantage of this product over X-Lite is the administration integration that Mark was just alluding to. Once you've created an account... So, Naveen, can you see it? Okay, good. And, and set up X-Lite. What, what, what you'll end up with is an administration portal, which will show you where the licenses are in your company and where they've been used. Mm -hmm. So this gives the advantage of, let's say, this user here. You have fired. Okay. <laughs> if you go to this page here, and I turn off his, his license, somewhere between 30 seconds a minute, longer in a real-world scenario, this client will stop working. And so, okay. uh, and that, what, what that means is that you, you turn off his account at the asterisk level, but you also turn off his account here at this level. I see. Okay. And as you can see, so you can see it's been deregistered. It's been deregistered. And if you made a mistake, you can uh, re-enable it, and then when you restart the client over here, it'll work again. The other main advantage of this solution is all you had to do to configure this for your end users was download the binary. We use DHCP and we're rolling in MDNS as solutions to find the asterisk server without any configuration details. So MDNS is the bonjour, right, from Apple? Protocol. Yeah, we don't have that one yet. We, right now we just have DHCP. But um, between the two technologies, your end users almost never have to t type any configuration details. So that's cool. So does other Astros distribution like, you know, for example, Droot, my company's voice routes one, or even uh, Trixbox, can they use XPro for Astros? They can, and we'd also be quite willing to roll our configuration module into your product bundlings. We are moving them into Asterix Now edition in the future, and uh, it'd be quite in Asterix BE. And uh, yeah, you could probably include the module after some, but yeah. And, and if we, could, we could let you guys integrate it with it as well. Okay, sounds good. So we look forward to putting uh, X-Pro into uh, Druid. But before, yeah, X-Pro for Asterisk in Druid. So in any case, can you show us a little bit of the XMPP presence no, stuff? No, but that's, we're doing that after the beta because we haven't integrated it with the Asterix uh, open source. With the Asterix business edition, it would just work. But okay. with Asterix open source, no. But I could, we do a full XMPP support in the product. It's just in the Bria product line. 
So it just needs to be merged into this product line after the, it is a late part of the beta. Derek, thank you. Thanks. So there, users, you have it. Uh, basically, X Pro for Asterisk will be available soon, for, probably in four weeks. And you can get the URL, yeah, the beta now, with extra licenses. With extra licenses. And, uh, we'll put a URL for where you can get X Pro for Asterisk. X Pro at counterpat.com or www.softphone.com slash asterisk. Thank you, Mark, again. Yeah.